Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Demarion, and this is the BBTV News for Monday, April 2nd, 2018. Hi, Bobcats. I'm Emily, starting you off with our top stories of the day. The former Dance Mom star, Abby Lee Miller, has been released early from prison and is now in a halfway house. Abby was originally in prison for bank fraud. Hi Bobcats, I'm Dylan. Researchers in Australia have discovered mummy remains in a 2,500 year old coffin. The coffin had been untouched for 175 years after it was assumed robbers had stolen the remains. A routine check by the University of Sydney who acquired the coffin in 1860 revealed there was in fact bones, cloth, beads, and other items inside. Hieroglyphics on the coffin say it contains the remains of a woman who researchers believe was a prestigious high priestess from 600 BC. Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Brock, and you've just entered the BBTV Sports Zone. First up in Buffett Sports this week, we want to say good luck to all to our boys and girls soccer teams, also our boys and girls track team. The soccer team will play at home, boys soccer and the track team will have a meet at Bryan. For today's sports feature, we're going to take a look at the world of MLB. Since the regular season started last week, we will give our predictions for the World Series games. Our AL East, we have the New York Yankees winning their division because of their trade for home run leader Giancarlo Stanton during the offseason. For the third year, we have the Cleveland Indians winning the AL Central. Led by the MVP candidate Francisco Lindor and all-star pitcher Corey Kluber. Out of the AL West, we have the Houston Astros winning the division, just barely over the Los Angeles Angels. For the wild cards in the AL, we have predicted the Boston Red Sox and the Los Angeles Angels will play for a spot in the World Series. Now on to the National League. From the East, we have the Washington Nationals winning the division, led by star Bryce Harper. We have the W flag flying for the Cubs and their trip back to the World Series this year. Last but not least, from the West, we have the Los Angeles Dodgers winning by one game over the Colorado Rockies for the, new, for the, for the World Series champion. For the World Series champion, we have the New York Yankees over the Cubs in seven games. That's all for sports today. Now onto the bench. Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Mary with today's Buffett Binge. First up, we are going to be looking at the new movies coming out this April. These include A Quiet Place, The Miracle Season, Spinning Man, Barrett, 10 Times 10, Rampage, Truth or Dare, I Feel Pretty, and Avengers Infinity War. Which ones are you planning on seeing this April? Hi Bobcats, I'm Brandon and I'm here with the daily announcements. First up, remember to charge your laptop overnight. April is state testing month, so it's very important to come to school with your computer charged and ready to go. Remember, if you're having any issues with your computer, make sure to talk with your teacher or fill out the form on the Buffett website. We know that you're excited for summer to come, but do you have any ideas what you would like to do? There is a bunch of summer camps that you could attend to. For more information, check out the Buffett Bulletin in your email, talk with Ms. Thompson, or pick up an info in the front office. Good afternoon, Bobcats. I'm Jalen. I'm here with the Before We Go segment. Today, we will be looking at one and only Queen Bee, also known as Beyonce. Celebrities have been having fun with the new game, Ryan Murphy, based on Beyonce, named American Crime Series. Who bit Beyonce? The name came from Tiffany Haddish that said in an interview that had unidentified actress bit superstar singer Beyonce on the face at a party last December. 
Ever since the, then, the game had has been taking off. Thanks for watching our broadcast today. I'm Demarion. Have a great Monday, and we'll see you tomorrow.